Hello siblings, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure to press subscribe and turn on those post notifications. So today I'm gonna be telling you guys about my new job. I've been keeping it somewhat of a secret, but I finally passed my test, I got my license, and I'm excited to tell you guys what exactly I'm going to be doing, so stay tuned for that. First, I'm gonna go take some pictures, some cute, just like little businessy vibe pictures, I'm wearing like a business vibe outfit with my friend Charlie. Just, these aren't like professional photos or anything that I'm gonna use on the website or business cards or anything like that. This is just uh, for Instagram. <laughs> so, we're gonna go take those. The sun is like setting right now, so I really don't have the time to explain anything. So, I'll tell you about my job when we get back. All right, we're just gonna go somewhere down the street real quick. Okay, the light turned green, so gotta go. Oh wait, no it didn't. Uh, my hair is literally still wet, so that's a vibe. Oh, it did turn, nope, did it? Okay, it did, gotta go. <laughs> it feels so good outside. It's probably like 60s, maybe even, no, yeah, probably 60s. Anyway, there's just this blank wall right here we're gonna take pictures on, and I brought another jacket as well. Wonder if I could use this wall to set up my camera. Oh, it's like a downward angle, hello. Okay, I think that's the best I can do for the vlog. We finished taking pictures. It was just like a quick little thing. Before I explain my job, I just want to say, like, look how, like, silver the bottom of my hair is. So, like, platinum. I got the Olaplex line, all of it, and I got the purple shampoo. Best purple shampoo I've literally has ever used in my entire life. It's insane. Even I swear when I dyed it, it wasn't even this bright. Okay, so these pictures were just for fun, as I said, because when I do take actual pictures for, like, whatever I need them for, like, the website for the company where, like, I'll have to wear, like, a badge with my license in it, I want to wait till I have all blonde hair, and I might take out my nose ring. I don't know, it's just a little unprofessional. Uh, but then so are tattoos and uh, yeah. All right, everyone guess down below. I've been dragging this out. I don't think I've ever dragged something out this long before. Comment what you think I got a license for. A lot of you guys said real estate and that's probably the most common one. Honestly, it might even be the only one just cause like I didn't know this was really a thing. Like I did, but I didn't. So that makes sense why you guys thought that. But I am officially a licensed life insurance agent. It sounds so anticlimactic, but let me just explain exactly what I'm gonna be doing. First of all, this is my, I'm covering my address, official Texas life insurance agent individual, and I haven't legally changed my name yet, so that's why it says Forsyth. But anyway, basically I'm gonna be working for this company where it's fully commission-based, and I will be selling mortgage protection policies. So what they do is they send out this form that people can fill out after they pull out a mortgage from a bank, and it's like, hey, are you interested in mortgage protection? If they are, then they fill it out, and then I buy those leads from this company. There's a whole bunch of like different kind of leads, old leads, new leads, and that varies on the price of them, but I buy them and I do calling, so I don't do any cold calls, so it's all warm leads, and I will call. So like the first hour of every day, I'll probably do calling. I set appointments for the day, so if I have three appointments today, I will go out to the house. I have a binder with a whole presentation. I've been getting training on this. I started my training for it like a little bit while ago while I was studying to go pass my test, which I passed the first time. I got an 85, let's go. So I'll go to people's houses that I make appointments with and be like, hey, this is what we sell. And we represent, so my company represents a ton of carriers. This might sound boring to you guys, but I'm just trying to explain what I'm doing. So we represent a ton of carriers so that we can offer like the best deals. And we also have specific deals with our company that you can't get if you go directly with the carrier or whatever. So the carrier would be like the actual insurance and we represent them. So I'm like, this is what you can do. Tell me all like your medical history, your age, your how much money you make and we'll get you a plan that works in your budget and gets your house protected. And basically what mortgage protection does is if you get sick, like deathly ill or you die, then there's this death benefit that can also be used as living benefits, which is unique for this life kind of life insurance where if you get really, really sick, you can pull out the money in your policy and and use it to pay your mortgage. So no matter what happens in your life, your mortgage will be covered and won't be left on your living relatives if you die. And
and you won't be required to keep working if something happens and you can't work anymore. So it's just a really good overall like protection. I'll probably get it on my house once I buy another house, hopefully here. Um, anyway, the reason I decided to do this is just because I had been feeling very like stuck in my ways with YouTube and I had been wanting to do something else. Not give up on YouTube, obviously I still love you guys. I'll keep doing this, I do love doing this, but I kind of had lost my passion for it in the past like year or two and wanted to do something else, but it was really scary thinking about doing something else. So my friend, Abram, if you guys remember Abram from my vlogs, was like, I'm gonna get my life insurance agent license because there's a lot of like really good and good paying jobs in life insurance. And I was like, oh, okay, that sounds cool. And then he found this company, which is like a really, really dope company. It's commission based. I literally start at 70% commission. I can work my way up. I, I can become a regional manager depending on how hard I work and it's really good money. <laughs> so I'm pretty excited about that. So we're actually both doing it. So we'll probably be like, they'll probably be in my vlogs here and there. I don't know, us working together. And I went and bought like a printer and we've both been using it and just kind of like helping each other out, listening to all the Zoom stuff, like Zoom meetings and calls and all that together. So it's been a lot of fun, not only doing it alone, but with one of my friends and the group that I'm a part of is super cool. Like my like upline manager replies really quickly. We have this big group chat where we hype each other up. Everyone puts in like, how much they're making that day. It's a really good motivation and I'm just really, really excited about this opportunity. What else is there? So yeah, I decided to do it just because I wanted to branch out a little bit and not have content creator be my full-time job because I was just feeling very burnt out on it and I still want to do it just more of like on the side for fun passion project rather than a full-time income. So I guess that's where I'm at. I'm really excited to start into a new chapter of my life and this feels like such an adult job, like wearing business clothes, which I don't have to wear business professional. In fact, they recommend we wear business casual, not professional, but there will be times like if I'm getting my picture taken or doing some sort of business meeting where I might want to look a little more professional. So I went and got like blazers and stuff. But anyway, I'm really excited. That was just like a quick little summary, I guess, of what I'm going to be doing. If you guys have any questions, feel free to comment them down below. So basically where I stand right now is I passed my test on Friday and and today I started submitting my contract with the company I'll be working with. I'm actually just waiting tomorrow. I have to go get a bank letter for my bank account and my writing, routing number and all that so they can put direct deposit commission into my bank account. Let's go, best part of the job, right? And <laughs> what else was I gonna say? I did everything else. I had to take an anti-money laundering course, just did that today. I had to get my license, obviously, and then just a bunch of other like little paperwork, questionnaire stuff, signed contracts, and I'm gonna send that in tomorrow after I get my bank letter. And then all the carriers have to approve me as an agent to work for them. And then once I get approved by all them, I am also doing like training and getting prep work, like my binder's ready for home presentation, learning how to do that, learning how to call, and all the stuff to actually do the job as well as get approved for the job, all kind of at the same time. So hopefully. Hopefully like December 1st I can start. I'm really hoping December will be a good month of just like learning and like figuring out how to work my own schedule and work super hard. And then start January, I'm gonna freaking grind, grind, grind. Honestly, just see like how much money I can make in a year because a lot of the people that work at this company end up making a lot of money their first year when they work super hard. I'm pretty excited to just work. I love working. I find a lot of um, motivation for life in working, so. Yeah, I'm pretty excited. I still get to build my own schedule. I'm still self-employed because I'm a contracted agent and work my own hours. As much as I work is as much money as I make. So that's a good and bad at the same time. Wish me luck. That's my new job. Yay! Oh, and I told both my parents and they're both super, super excited for me. So I don't know if that was gonna be a question, but there we go. Did I say what? The part about me. With YouTube? Yeah. So I might end up having Charlie be my little YouTube assistant since I'll be busy and she's gonna be living with me starting in March so then she can help me record my YouTube videos, edit my YouTube videos, make my thumbnails, get content with me so I don't completely give up on YouTube because I'm gonna get busy really, really fast. So if the videos start getting worse, it's her job. That's the idea. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm That's just kidding. Idea. I'm gonna teach her, I'm gonna train her. It's gonna be a really fun time and then she'll be in a lot of the videos, so stay tuned. Yeah.